how you all do it. We're going up to in this video. Well, let's find out. Over the past couple of years, I've been picking up uh, old bicycle parts, normally left outside people's gates on the street. I think I've got a decent collection. So, which frame should I use? We've got two rallies. We've got a giant, which you're all screaming, build the giant. And we've got a Shogun Dirt Jump series. I'm thinking of going with the Shogun. Main reason being that uh, it's an alloy frame, alloy forks, even the bottoms of alloy, whereas the giant, the metal forks, the frame is a bit battered up as well. So yes, I think I'm going to go with the Shogun. Uh, we've got the rally bikes, but they're metal frames. So, I've had a quick look around it, so what do we need? We've got all the brakes, I think we need all the new cables, all the cables seem to be knackered, so we need a set of cables. The trailer gears are there, main crank crossovers are there, brakes are there on the front, got zoom forks on it, whatever that means, and when the forks are stuck so they are froze up. Uh, we'll have to investigate that. Steering stab bearings are nice and smooth. Uh, the angle bars, I'm going to change them for the rally ones. Hopefully if they fit. Hopefully they're the same size. There. Oh, and we found the seat. The seat is a bit battered, which is a shame, but it's no problem. I can get a gel seat cover very expensive stick it over the top of that and I think this must have been a good quality bike because even the seat goes up and down. It's got uh, fixings here for disc brakes the same on the forks fix in there for disc brakes and I love the way the frame is like tube and it goes out uh, into the box section Pretty awesome. I found the wheels, but uh, the back axle has snapped on this one, so we'll have to source a new axle. I'm not sure if they're the correct wheels for it, but they're the ones I'm using. So let's get cracking.
that in. That's all the forks done. I've cleaned all the uh, chain setup and the derailleurs, derailleurs, derailleur gears up. Uh, found an axle for the wheel. This is the rear wheel. I've took the cog off. It is a little clip of how I did it. Let's sort the wheels out and fit them to the bike. Now the bike's standing on two wheels, let's sort out the brakes and gears and cables.
two pound on angle grips. Uh, I can get a gel seat cover which has got a red top which will go on there nice but I haven't got it yet. And that's it. So now I can have lots of fun on a decent mountain bike in the countryside. Thanks for watching.